The Daily Grind brought to you by Grind TV. We're going to put a button. Epic day here. Due tour 2016. Chris Cote here with Chris Pastris. We've had a minute to sit back and let that win marinate. Ryan Sheckler. He did it with consistency. He did it with trick selection. He did it with all terrain mastery. Definitely, it was super good to see Sheckler dominant all day long. This contest, you know, really, he really had to do every single type of skateboarding. He had the tech section, which was kind of mellow and small. I didn't expect Sheckler to dominate that like he did. We had the bowl section, like you mentioned. You had to be fluid, coming off an eight-foot wall into a five-foot wall. We had the rail section, so you had to get a little gnarly, skate some long, long flat rails and some bumped rails. And then finally, you had to go gnar with the gap section, and Sheckler uh, shined. It was tricky, man. A lot of skateboarding, um, super diverse, a lot of pressure, and you know Ryan Sheckler thrives off pressure. Well, folks, you are watching how this guy won 2016 Dude Tour. We're talking about Ryan Sheckler came through like a wrecking ball. Tech, full, rail into the gap section. Pretty much just ripped all day long. And if that wasn't enough, he took him right off the course, made him run up 10 flights of stairs, and join <laughs> us here on the Daily Grind. Ryan Sheckler, welcome to the booth. The smile on your face tells the story. I see relief, I see stoke, I see joy in just a great day of skateboarding. Man, it just, uh, you know, it's, it started from the first day of practice here. Like, the whole vibe of the contest is so much different than what, you know, we're all used to with the minute runs and, you know, you have to wait so long in between. It wasn't like that at all. And I've always loved Dew Tour and just, I, I love the dudes that skate Dew Tour because it's so much different, man. It, it's so laid back, so relaxed. And, you know, especially with this format, you start in the, you know, tech section, which I thought I was going to do bad on. So I was like, all right, cool. I'm going to be able to just like scoot away from that one, get into the bowl. And um, it just turned out today just worked out perfectly. I've been putting in a lot of hard work. Um, I've been injured, but I've been doing the steps to, to get my body right and just to get my mental right and just to really love skateboarding again. And today was just a perfect example of what happens when you're having fun. How much does strategy play into it? Because I notice you get some tricks in the bag and then you move on and they kind of build momentum and difficulty. How much does strategy factor in? I accidentally had perfect strategy today. <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> dude, I wasn't planning on it at all. Um, I just didn't want to fall. I, I knew that with the heats going and that many tries going, I figured the more you stay on your board, the higher your score is going to be because there's four different scores you had to get. So I was just trying to, you know, I was trying to play the game, but then also do tricks that I really wanted to do that um, I thought would get some some good scores. Switch gears. Yep. Now it comes into the team play. Oh yeah. Aspect oh yes. That we're all super psyched on for tomorrow. Coming into the team. I can't going wait. With plan B. You guys yeah. got a heavy hitting squad, but. Oh, yeah. When you're walking around, you see, you know, Toy Machine, Enjoy, you see so many names, the biggest, best skate companies in the world. How is your team going to shine in tomorrow's team competition? What do you mean, dude? It's plan B <laughs> all the way. Now that the contest is over, this is into the team sport. Plan B's got this 100%. And you guys got any surprises planned? Um, Jagger's full of surprises, dude. We put him on the rail section because he's so gnarly. So uh, we'll see what he can pull out. And then we got Scott DeCenzo in the tech section. Um, What's Jocelyn skating? Jocelyn skating the gaps, and then, uh, yeah, I got the bowl. So we're just gonna have fun, man, especially from today, like carrying this momentum into tomorrow. Um, we already got plan B on the podium, so we're good. Okay, and obviously plan B, you're rooting for them. They're your homies, that's your sponsor. Who else do you like to see out there? Oh man, Leo's been ripping. Brian DeCenzo's obviously ripping. I love watching Kern skate. Uh, Louis, man, dude, everybody out there is absolutely ripping. Well, here's a look at the teams you're up against tomorrow. We're going to start with Plan B. Of course, no favorites here in the booth unless yeah, you yeah, yeah. check it, of course. <laughs> but yeah, Team Plan B, like I said, heavy hitters all the way. You guys brought the A-list team with you. Here's a little look kind of behind the scenes. You guys get your little zones to hang out Yeah, in. We, we haven't set up our zone yet. Tomorrow that thing's going to be popping. <laughs> Interior decorator from Plan B HQ is coming down here to make that shine. Team Element, Team Flip. Uh, this this three pack of teams right here, to me, that is kind of the, the hot corner right it's now heavy. as far as yeah. all terrain vehicles. It's Who, definitely who's heavy. the team to beat beyond Plan B? Who's the team to beat? Who's the team to beat? Flip, man. Flip. Kern and Louie. Those dudes are so good. So we'll see. And then, you know, you got the Baker team coming out here, which is going to be epic to watch them skate. They all rip, skate their own style, and just. 
have so much fun. They're always having fun. Birdhouse obviously rips, and I want to see Deloy go ham tomorrow. So I'm just excited, man. This is a great weekend. The sun's been out all weekend. Long Beach is the best, and we're just cruising. Hell okay. yeah. Well, as you see, the teams will be joining us all tomorrow. Sunday is going to be another amazing day of skateboarding here, live from Long Beach. I can't wait to see how the specialists come in to play. We're talking about home run hitters in their comfort zones. Today was kind of about getting skaters out of their comfort zones. Tomorrow it's going to be about putting skaters where they specialize. So I want to get your final thoughts on today. Look forward to tomorrow. Put a button on this championship day for Ryan Man, Sheckler. dude, my final thoughts today was absolutely epic. I love Dew Tour. I love that they put this skateboarding contest on for skateboarders. And uh, I just want to thank God and Jesus Christ, man. Thank you. Uh, such a blessing. And try it again tomorrow. Hell yeah. Well, we will be back tomorrow with the team aspect of Dew Tour 2016, 1.30 p.m. Join us tomorrow. Of course, tons of social media going on. This is The Daily Grind brought to you by Grind TV. And, uh, man, you better get a good night's sleep. You got a full day of skating tomorrow. Uh, we'll and be we good. I can do it again back. right now. <laughs> Let's go for it. We'll see you guys tomorrow. You.